Hello everybody and welcome back to my Minecraft episode 12 and I have my quarry set up and we just gotta do the finishing touches actually have um, the storage set up over at my uh, base already so quarry items actually went you on the other side Put power on this yep and put this guy over here chest on top like so transfer node and transfer pipe we can move this over here so now this guy's going to be sending and you should receive and hopefully this should be going now but it isn't for some reason that's my power's low we can quickly go check the port whoa major lag spike not sure what the deal is okay your power is going down energy mode sent only do I not have something configured correctly? oh, there we go awesome hopefully our power system can keep up with this so that should be good and dandy and work just fine so now we have a quarry up and running, I did actually run a test one uh, just a small little one to make sure everything was set up correctly and yeah so that should be going good and this didn't have any items and we can go back to the main base and let's quickly go sleep so we can get through the night and off camera I made some uh, biofuel generators. Now I need to make the reactors, which we can make this episode. But I want to make some ender chests in case we need them. Or actually an ender chest and an ender pouch. So I believe it's obsidian. Blazer rods. Wool. And ender pearl and a chest. Somehow worked in here. Um we can actually click on the recipe wherever it is uh... there it is okay, one of those and let's make an ender pouch which we need place powder and leather for i think i have leather programmed into my system over here is my stuff and a bunch of this well, I think most of it so far is from the other quarry I ran. So that's doing pretty good. Leather. So I need three. Let's grab four just to be on the safe side. And there we are. So ender pouch and awesome. So now all we need to do is place this somewhere put it there. Let's put our um, landmarks, the chest, some torches, and um, another chest, and some food. So now if we go anywhere in the world, we can get access to our stuff. If we look in the window and look to the left, you can actually see the chest opens. And the nice thing about this over a backpack is you can have it suck items out into like an applied energistic system or if you get blown up and your bag gets destroyed somehow your items are still safe and another thing I got while I was off camera is I found another uh, boulder with an inscriber plate and an inscriber silicon press so now I have all the things to start applied energistics I We'll probably do most of the crafting for that off camera because it is pretty tedious, but anyway we have that and um 
Did I do anything else? Not really. I made some uh, energy collectors, which I'm still figuring out how to use. And I just have a Klein Star thingy. And I didn't teach this thing too much else. I taught it how to make the biofuel things. So we have those going. This guy's generating mana. And I need a way to get rid of this sludge. Not sure if I'm going to boil it down yet or not. And yeah. So let's look into a bioreactor. Okay, so the fermented spider eye was a thing I had a problem with. Don't know if I know of any spider spawners. I don't think so, at least. Although... Okay, yeah, let's go to there. Hello? Give me your eyeballs. Perfect. And... Yeah, we only need one. So we need sugar and... A mushroom, I think. We need some sugar cane. I had this earlier, but I have no idea what happened to it. There's a mushroom. Sugar. Spider eye and mushroom. Awesome. And let's see, what else do I need? Slime balls. Plastic. And bricks. Hey, yeah, that's not too hard. So, one, two. And we can quickly cook those up. And I should soon charge my jackpack, but that's not too big of a deal. One brick, two, and we should be pretty much good to go. We can quickly teach this guy how to make. And I accidentally got rid of him. There we are. And spider eye you can learn and what else let's make ender pouches and I think that's all I can teach it so I need some plastic one two and a basic machine frame and we should be good to go so bricks in the bottom slime on there and hopefully I get this right the first time. And I believe I needed a silver coil. I'm just gonna guess, probably not, but nope. Sugar. Okay, well, you can go back in the thingy. And let's see if our quarry's working. Awesome. So, Lapis. Looks like we got some string. Doesn't seem like too much is going in though. It may be our power generation. You really have to bump that up. Okay, that would explain a lot. Yeah. Okay, that's a major issue. Why is this not working? And I know why that isn't. Um, let's quickly dump our inventory and fix this problem. There we go. I really need to sort this out. That's why I want to go to biofuel, but... For now, we're just going to have to deal with this. Unless I convert to lava, which I kind of don't want to do. There. Now, work. Are you going to work now? Those came on and... You should come on soon. Yeah, I'm on. Okay, those are on. And these ones still didn't get anything. Let's place these in manually. Hopefully they get filled up. 
This guy's slowly getting power. They're still fine. Let's charge our backpack. And I should... <coughs> sorry. I should actually... Uh, charge my armor because it's empty. But these guys can go... Here somewhere. Um... Put them there. And do we have fluiducts? We used to. Okay, I'll have to grab some of them. I do not want to make a waypoint. And you are done. Awesome. Why are you not keeping after? Oh, well. Do you need more speed? Yeah, that would probably be ideal. And I believe I have those put into here, so... Speed upgrade. Let's get four of those guys. And what I can do is, all the dirt and stuff from the quarry, I can actually... There we go. So are you filling up now? Just chuck some more in manually. Okay, hopefully these guys sort themselves out. Looks like you're slowly doing it. Anyway, that's enough with that. And I hit all my food again. Which I constantly, for some reason, keep doing. Okay, I don't need all that crap. Just those. And... Let's see what else. Probably that. And some torches. So now we have that going. And we needed sugar. For our thingy. There goes that. Sugar in there gets us a bioreactor. And... Craft one of those. Let's actually make a second one. Uh, let's make four just because. So that. And now we want to make a iron tank. So. There we are. So we need the wall, which shouldn't be too hard to make. That's there we are. Iron plates. Okay, that's pretty simple. And I will come back when I am done with the plating. Alrighty, and I am back. And I have made an iron wall tank thing. And I have biofuel being generated. Let me go into my normal form. So over here I have the biofuel generators. Then I have my tank, which can hold 576 buckets of uh, biofuel. And I have these four guys running on saplings at the moment. Which you can barely even tell they're going because it's uh, sucking stuff through that fast. If we chuck one in, yeah, it burns through saplings. And you can see the little bit of stuff goes out. And the more stuff that goes through it constantly is the um, more efficient it gets. So we should be able to hook up the apple barrel, if I do it correctly. Oops. Put that like that. Now if we put a transfer node off those into... this one it should hopefully go into there so those are getting sucked out and I believe apples get sucked through the uh, biofuel generators as well it's too bad we can't check but as long as it's not jamming up, I'm assuming it's working. At least I hope so, at least. 
or I said at least twice, but anyway, so these guys are just dyed black because I felt like it, and our power is still horrendous, so I really need to get uh, this working a little bit better. I may add another farm or two, or what I can do, I think anyway, I can quick test this. I grab some leaves. I may be able to use the uh, shearing thing. Can I? No, I cannot. And... You can't do anything. Okay, so that won't work. Um, hmm. Well, those are basically useless then. Other than if I need them for decorations, which probably won't happen as I didn't even finish my house yet. You got a decent amount in you. Let's drain you out. And put you over here. So that's looking pretty good. Our mana production. Let's check how that's going. That's pretty decent. I disabled this mana spider just so I could keep track of it more. I think something's a little bit off because these don't quite seem to be making as much as they could. Um, so I'm not sure what the deal was with that. Yeah, because if I click on these, that, I don't know what the deal was. Anyway, let's hop over to our quarry and see how it's doing. So you're keeping after pretty well. And you didn't even start, you're at level 56. One second. Alrighty everyone, I am back. Sorry about that interruption. It is the next uh, two days later, so I apologize for the beginning of the video sounding horrible. That was like at uh, 9 at night after a long day of doing stuff. Anyway, our quarry is down to like level 54 now. And I actually have it shut off so I can build up my power supply again. And yeah, that's basically it for this episode. Next episode, I'll probably set up some sledge boiling stuff so we can get that going. And yeah, maybe some other stuff. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. I will try and uh, be more energetic with my next ones. But uh, yeah, so that's it for now. And I'll see you next time. This is Heller, signing out.